Just in case you missed it, June the 18th was a national day of making in the United States. President Obama called upon Americans to observe the day with programs, ceremonies and activities that encourage a new generation of makers and manufacturers to share their talents and hone their skills. The maker movement is empowering ordinary people to hack their world, to make it better, more interesting and a more vibrant place, and to make it safer. We live in a world where millions of people have to handle greater risks to their health and well-being than they should. Did you know, for instance, that one billion people are still forced to defecate in the open, leading to thousands of unnecessary deaths and countless more diseases from contaminated water? Or that an estimated one in eight deaths globally are associated with air pollution, and that a shocking one in five Americans are dying from obesity-related diseases. These and other health challenges are crying out for grassroots solutions, the sort of solutions anyone with an imagination and some smart friends can come up with. Of course, hacking for public health isn't new. The physician John Snow was a 19th century public health hacking hero. In 1854 London, he connected an outbreak of cholera to a local water pump. To stop the disease spreading, he persuaded community leaders to remove the pump handle, a hack that saved lives and paved the way to modern disease control. And that's the beauty of the maker movement. Anyone can be a maker for health. And by anyone, I mean absolutely anyone. All you need is imagination and some maker friends who can help transform your ideas into inventions that can change the world. So if you want to become a maker for health, where do you start? The first step is finding a juicy challenge to get your creative teeth into. And here are five to get you thinking. Number one, save lives by getting creative about preventing poop-borne diseases. Number two, explore new ways to get people off their butts and moving around. Three, help people eat smart by making it easier for them to get access to healthy food. Four, Give people more control over the pollution they breathe using smartphones, smart sensors, and smart communication. Five, get imaginative about ways to slow the spread of antimicrobial resistant bacteria. There are plenty more public health challenges out there just waiting for creative individuals to team up with designers, tech geeks, health professionals, and others to come up with innovative solutions. So why not become a maker for health? Go hack your world help make it a safer place.